If you follow the SMART framework, you will be able to set good goals for your social media in order to achieve your overall business goals. Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Joy Akatkunda Williams and here we talk about all things social media marketing and digital marketing. So today I'm going to be sharing how to set SMART social media goals. When setting any goals, you need to keep in mind and ask yourself, are my goals SMART? By SMART, I mean specific, measurable, attainable, realistic, and time-bound. When setting social media goals, you need to ask yourself, how are my social media goals relating to my general business goals? You need to ask yourself if social media is going to be at the core of your digital marketing strategy. Once you answer these questions, you will be able to set and refine your goals to achieve the best results. So, before you set your goals, make sure to follow the SMART framework and we are going to see SMART means specific, measurable, attainable, realistic and time-bound. Let's look at this in details. Number one, your goal must be specific. A specific goal is one that clearly states the expected results. This is a goal that is easily understood by everyone in the organization. Each member of the team knows exactly what this goal is supposed to achieve. To make sure that your goal is specific enough, you have to answer the five W's. And these are why, where, who, what, and when. To make this more clear, I will give you examples of questions to phrase in order to answer the five W's. For whom do you want to achieve this? Why do you want to achieve this? When do you want to achieve this? What do we need to achieve this? Where are we going to achieve this from? Once you're able to answer the five W questions, then your goal will have achieved the specific quality. Then you can go on to the next quality. The second quality of a SMART goal is measurable. You have to be able to measure the success of a goal. If you can't measure how well a goal will do, then it might become impossible to track or even achieve this goal. If you cannot measure how well your goal is doing, then you will not know whether you are doing poorly and improve your efforts or if you're doing well and maintain or even do better with your efforts. So, in order to know how you're standing with your goal, make sure that your goal is measurable so that you have the right metrics to know how you are standing with your goal. The third quality of a SMART goal is attainable. You have to make sure that you set a goal that you can achieve. Make sure that your goal is not out of reach of your resources so that it becomes impossible for you to attain. For example, you can't start a business today and tomorrow you say that your goal is to buy a car for the business. That would be impossible because you have to start small keep progressing and get the things you want at a later stage. So make sure as you start out, set goals that you can achieve. Depending on the size of your business, set goals that are in the range of your business according to the resources you have and the number of people that you have. The fourth aspect of a SMART goal is realistic. You have to make sure that your goal is relevant to your overall business goal. Your social media goals tie directly to the business goals of the organization. For example, you can set a social media goal such as using social media to increase website traffic, yet your business does not have a website. That goal would not be relevant to your business because you don't have a website, so it's not a realistic goal. So make sure as you're setting goals, Keep them relevant to your overall business goals and make sure that they make sense for your business. The fifth and last element of a SMART goal is time-bound or timely. A goal that is timely helps you to maximize your efforts so that you can beat deadlines. Let's take an example. Let's say you have a YouTube channel and you want to increase subscribers. One person sets a goal get 2,000 subscribers and another person sets a goal get 2,000 subscribers by October. Which goal or which person do you think 
is more likely to achieve their goal faster. I say the person who set a goal that is bound by time will be able to achieve it. Why? Because setting a time frame for your goals makes you work harder to achieve your goal within the time in which you have set it. Therefore, endeavor to set timely goals. And there you have it. If you follow the SMART framework, you will be able to set good goals for your social media in order to achieve your overall business goals. Pro tip, make sure to keep the social media platform and your ideal audience in mind because different social media platforms require different goals and different strategies. If you love this video, make sure to like, subscribe, comment and even share with a friend who might need this. I'll see you in my next video. Thank you. Bye-bye.